everybody in this lecture let us discuss about lcm and hcf right so i am doing the two videos on this in that nearly 19 questions i am covering in that 19 questions i am trying to cover all the models which will be given on lcm and hcf problems right also the questions you can see here the first before going for the questions lcm means least common multiple hcf means highest common factor or we can also call it as gcd greatest common divisor right now if we take the fractions if you want to find the fractions hcf we will write as hcf of numerators by lcf of denominators lcm we will write it as lcm of numerators by hcf of denominators so the first question is find the lcm of 24 36 40 40. so he gave certain options we have to see which chance suits so 24 36 40 i wrote 2 12 24 2 18 36 2 into 20 40 again these 3 are divisible by 2 2 6s are 12, 2 9s are 18, 2 10s are 20. Again here this is except 9, these two are divisible by 2, 2 3s are 6, 9 is not divisible so we, will, we have to write as it is. Next 2 5s are 10, again here 3 and 9 are divisible by 3, so 3 1s are 3, 3 3s are 9 and 5 as it is we wrote. Now, how we will write LCM 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 1 into 3 into 5. So, we are having 2 cube into 3 square into 5. So, 2 cube 8, 3 square 9 and this is 5. And if we multiply this, we will get answer as 360. So, option C is the correct answer. Similarly, let us find HCF of 36 and 84. So, I will write by long division method we are doing 84 divided by 36. 36 twos are 72. Reminder 12. Again 36 I will write here. Now 12 threes are 36. Reminder 0. So, HCF is 12. C is correct option now similarly here only two numbers are given if three numbers are given then how to find the hcf if three numbers are given you first you find the hcf of any two numbers and you will get the hcf value now again you find the hcf with the third number and that uh, value which you got so you will get the final hcf so here I got I wrote 108, 36, 36 and 90. So first I am choosing these two numbers. Any two you can choose. First I am choosing these two numbers. So 90 divided by 36. 36 twos are 72. Reminder comes out to be 18. Again 36 I am dividing with 18. So 18 twos are 36 reminder 0 so now here hcf is so hcf of 36 and 90 is 18 again i will do the hcf of 108 and 18 so now 108 18 18 6 are 108 reminder 0 so, the overall HCF is 18. Option C is the correct answer. Alright. Now, next. Now, let us find the HCF of 2 by 3, 4 by 5, 6 by 7. If fractions are given in such a way, in the starting only I said the formula now. HCF is equal to hcf of numerators hcf of numerators divided by lcm of 
डिनोमिनेटर्स एल सी एम ऑफ डिनोमिनेटर्स सो वॉट वी हैव टू डू वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द एच सी एफ ऑफ टू फोर सिक्स सो एज यूजल चूज एनी टू नंबर्स हियर आई एम चूजिंग टू फोर एनी टू सो टू टू जार फोर सो एच सी एफ ऑफ टू एंड फोर इज टू सो एच सी एफ ऑफ टू एंड फोर इज टू अगेन वॉट आई विल डू विथ दिस टू अगेन आई विल फाइंड द एच सी एफ ऑफ टू एंड सिक्स टू थ्री जार सिक्स सो एच सी एफ ऑफ न्यूमरेटर्स इज ओवरऑल एच सी एफ इज टू डिवाइडेड बाई नेक्स्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड द एल सी एम ऑफ डिनोमिनेटर्स वॉट आर द डिनोमिनेटर्स थ्री फाइव सेवन दिस थ्री आर डिफरेंट फ्रॉम ईच अदर दे आर नॉट डिविजिबल बाई एनी थिंग सो थ्री इंटू फाइव इंटू सेवन वॉट इट विल कम आउट एज वन नॉट फाइव सो आंसर इज टू बाई वन नॉट फाइव ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट नो नेक्स्ट the similar problem but here we have to find the lcm for lcm what is the formula for fractions it is lcm of numerator by hcf of denominator so what we have to do i have to find the first lcm of numerators what are the numerators 2 4 5 2 4 5 so 2 4 5 2 and 4 are divisible by 2 1 2 2 ones are 2 2 2 4 5 so lcm becomes 2 into 1 into 2 into 5 that is 2 square into 5 that is 4 into 5 which is nothing but 20 so lcm of numerators is 20 now next we have to find hcf of denominator hcf of uh, what is the denominator 3 9 6 3 so first as usual choose any two terms so here i am choosing 3 9 first 3 3 is 9 so hcf of 3 and 9 is 3 now next i have to find the hcf of this 3 and the remainder number 6 so 3 6 3 twos are 6 right so 3 twos are 6 so answer comes out to be 2 okay so 3 3s are 9 so hcf is 3 now 3 2s are 6 so answer comes out to be 20 by 2 may right so option 20 by 2 must be there okay now next let us go for the seventh problem here what he gave means the least number which when divided by 5 6 7 8 leaves a remainder 3 the least number okay but when divided by 9 leaves no remainder so we have to find that number when these numbers divided by least 9 does not leave remind i think you understood the question he is asking is that these particular numbers when divided by certain least number they got the remainder 3 now when these numbers are divided by 9 there must not be a remainder means what is that particular number which when divided will not by 9 will not leave the remainder okay so now for that first let us find out the lcm okay the lcm of 
five six seven eight so five six seven eight lcm right with two five two three zar six seven as it is we will write two four zar eight so lcm becomes two into five into three into seven into four the answer comes out to be some eight forty right now we want the number that particular number which does not leave the remainder when these are multiplied divided by 9 so required number is in the form of 840 some k is the required number plus 3 okay 3 is the remainder left when these are uh, divided by the least numbers so that becomes now first i will substitute one if i substitute one let us see it is correct or not 840 plus 3 843 when we divide with 9 what will be the answer 9 9s are 81 uh, we will get 33 33 means uh, 9 3s are 27 33 minus uh, 27 so what we will get 6 so we are getting a remainder 6 so k equal to 1 is the wrong option now let us substitute k equal to 2 So eight forty into two plus three, we will get some sixteen eighty three. When it is divided by nine, we will get one eighty seven. Reminder zero. Reminder zero. So what is that number? When divided by nine, reminder remains zero. That is nothing but sixteen eighty three. So one six eight three is the correct number. All right now next let us go for the seventh problem so he gave the lcm and hcf numbers 28 and 42 and he is asking their ratio all right so first let us find out the lcm of these two numbers then hcf lcm is 28 42 of these two numbers Two fourteen zar twenty eight two twenty one zar forty two. Again, these are divisible by two means two seven zar twenty one as it is. I am writing. Again, these two are divisible by seven. No, so seven one zar seven seven three zar how much twenty one. So now here two into two two square into Seven into three, so answer comes out to be eighty-four. Now similarly, let us find out HCF of twenty-eight forty-two. So here twenty-eight forty-two twenty-eight ones are twenty-eight, right? Now fourteen is the remainder. Again, I will divide twenty-eight with fourteen. Now fourteen. Two zar twenty eight. So now HCF is we got fourteen. LCM is eighty four. Now he is asking to find the ratio. Okay, so ratio will be eighty four divided by fourteen. That is six by one. Fourteen six zar eighty four. So ratio is. Six is to one, so option A is the correct answer. Now next, let us move for the eighth problem. So here he is saying that the greatest number by which the greatest number by which twenty three hundred and thirty five hundred are divided, leaving the remainders of thirty two and fifty six are the greatest number by which these two are divided. These are divided by some greatest number. When they are divided, these got the remainders as thirty-two and fifty-six. 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 Thirty-
32 and for this 56. He is asking to find that particular greatest number. Okay. So now for that first the required number first the required number is HCF of 2300 minus 32 when uh, it is divided with the greatest number the remainder is 32 we said no so only we wrote as HCF of 2300 minus 32 answer comes out to be 2268 similarly 3500 remainder left is 56 he said answer comes out to be 3444 4, 4. now greatest number he is saying means HCF only no so now 3444 4, 4 divided by uh, what is the answer here 2268 2, so 2268 2, ones are 2268 2, right so reminder is 1176 1, we will get and again we will divide 2268 2, with 1176 1, ones are 1176 one, so 2 uh, here we will get 901 one. again this we will divide with 1092 one, so 1092 one, ones are 1092 one, so 4 and here we will get a uh, 8 okay again 1092 is divided by 84 right 84 13 are 1092 so the greatest number by which 2300 and 3500 are divided leaves the remainder 32 and 56 are answer is 84 so d is the correct option now let us move for ninth question okay so ninth question is the smallest square number divisible by 10, 16, 24. 10, 16, 24. So, smallest square number he said. Okay. So, now let us take the LCM. Smallest means least. No. So, I am taking the uh, LCM of this least common multiple. So, LCM of 10, 16, 14. Let us do the LCM. Just doing LCM only. The smallest square number or LCM. 2, 5 is a 10. 2, 8 is a 16. 2, sorry, this is 24. 12 is a 24. Right? Again with 2, 5. Right? For 2, 4 is a 8. 2, 6 are 12, right? Again, 5, 2, 2 are 4, 2, 3 are 6, right? So, here see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 2 are there. 2 to the power of 4 into 5 into 3. Okay? The answer comes out to be 3600. So, option is D. Now, the 10th question here. The HCF and LCM of two numbers are 21 and 84 if the ratio of two numbers is 1 is to 4 then larger than the larger of two numbers then the larger of two numbers is he is asking the larger number to find out so HCF how much he gave HCF of numbers is 21 right so and LCM is 84. Now he is asking the larger number. So we are considering only HCF. No need of LCM. Right. So now here the numbers the ratio of two numbers he gave as 1 is to 4. No? Here HCF of numbers is 21 he said. 
of two numbers is twenty one. So let us write that two numbers as twenty one x, twenty one y, right? Where x and y you think as prime to each other, and the ratio what he gave, one is to four. So now the larger number we want. So larger number means we will consider four. So twenty one. Y, that is twenty one into four, that is equal to answer comes out to be eighty four. So the option D is correct. So now in such a way we will find the larger numbers. Okay. Uh, now watch my next video for the remaining models on HCF and LCM.